I was asked to show how I assign grades to the individual posts in a forum, and I think the easiest way for me to do that is just to walk you through it in uh, Moodle. So we'll go to my teaching workshop, and what I'll do is I will add this feature to the questions forum uh, because it happens to be here. So you come to the forum, uh, you edit the settings, uh, then what you have to do is come down to the uh, grading and under those circumstances we can do that in the ratings area and we can specify what type of rating and the choices are average. That gives you the average value for the ratings. It doesn't give you a count or anything. Uh, count is uh, a way of counting how many posts each student has. I tend to avoid that because it tends to encourage a lot of posts without a lot of content. Maximum looks for the best contribution of each student. Minimum uh, looks for the minimum contribution for each student. Are they wasting people's time? I prefer the sum of the ratings, which basically allows you to uh, total up all the ratings. So what you can do is you can choose a scale. Uh, it goes up to 100. Uh, say we chose a scale of 10. Uh, then you'd be able to rate each post 1 through 10. And as soon as the total for all the ratings of all the students' posts reach 10, it doesn't get any higher. So 10 is the maximum. So if you were to give student a 10 on a single post, then the student wouldn't have to post anymore to get the maximum uh, uh, grade. You can also restrict the dates uh, of the rating. And this is a very nice, convenient feature because it allows you to give some feedback to your student uh, in terms of the how you like their particular post. And when it comes time to grade, you basically have everything in the grade book because if we go over here now and we'll uh, save and return to course, now that we have this rated, if we come over to the grade book, what we will see is that now all of a sudden you have this ability to uh, look at uh, the ratings. <laughs> I actually have, uh, let's see if I can get the uh, proper scroll bar here. Okay. So if we come over here, if we take a look, for example, in the plagiarism in class project, I've been giving everybody a one. So we can see who has made posts thus far. Uh, and here's an individual, Louis Sanz, that uh, did 10 posts. Good for you, Louis. And uh, here's the new questions form, which has been added. And since I haven't rated anyone, we don't have any uh, points there. But this really makes it a lot easier to grade the things. And it means you only have to really read the posts once. Also, when you look things over and see you've already assigned a grade, then you know you don't have to read the thing again. Because one of the big problems I've had with these large discussions is you have to keep looking at the posts over and over again. So that's basically how to assign individual grades to posts, and I hope this has been useful.